Alrighty, what's up SITV? For our first segment we have uh, Steve Cummings, my boy. <laughs> Mr. Ralph is gonna go digging in his belt and uh, he's got some mysteries in there. He owes the BOCES, so who knows what we're gonna find in there. Hi, I'm Wale from SITV and today on What's Inside, we're taking a look at Steve's tool belt. We're start from over here, we have tape measure, screwdriver, uh, a bunch of nails and knickknacks, a pencil, and a uh, cashew granola bar. And of course, Steve's trusty red, white, and blue hammer. Let's see what else we can find. Uh, extra two by four. Bashel board. Another one of those. Level. Oh, there's some deep down here. As you can tell, Steve's got a lot of rubbish in that belt. Almost too much, you would say. But for our next segment, I'm getting a little mad with March Madness! Let's see what everyone's got for their picks as to who's gonna win it all. Okay, Dr. D, what are your final four teams? My final four teams are Northern Kentucky, Fairleigh Dickinson, no, I'm just kidding. My final four teams are Tennessee, North Carolina, Gonzaga, and Duke, and I'm gonna go with Gonzaga to win it all. Alrighty, thank you very much. Thank you. Virginia Tech, Syracuse, Villanova, and Utah State. And who do you have winning it all? Villanova. Duke, Michigan, North Carolina, and Virginia. And who do you have winning it all? I think North Carolina is going to sweep it out over Duke in a close one. Alright, right, I think the final four is going to be North Carolina, Tennessee, Duke, and Florida State. Alright, who do you think is going to win it all? North Carolina. Belmont, Buffalo, UC Irvine, and Houston winning it all. Instead of my final four, I'm going to give you my picks that I believe are going to happen. I'm picking Duke to win it all. I'm picking Zion to shoot over 60% from the field for the tournament. And I'm, and I'm picking two ACC teams making the final four. Um, I think North Carolina, Duke, UConn, and Michigan is going to win it all. Mr. Brigham definitely had some interesting thoughts on that. My pick for who's going to win it all, Suffolk Brentwood with starting point guard Max Morose. What do you think, Q? I think Tennessee is going to win. I think Admiral Sheffield is nice. So uh, the challenge of the week this week uh, seems pretty tough. Oh, yeah. Let's roll it. Peace. So I'm uh, here with Mr. Bird. going to do a cup challenge. If she gets it, she wins a decent game.
Yeah. Ah! Uh, nice challenge of the week, guys. As QD has brought up previously, we actually have some breaking news this time. So, uh, talk of the town right now is there's a Bigfoot going around. Yeah, he's laying in his nest somewhere in Sachem's Woods, and, uh, our crew set out to find him. The brave souls of Luke, Mitchell, and Jonas went out there to face their fears. I know he's real. I don't think I believe in Bigfoot. Bigfoot is real. He is in Sachem's Woods. Well, I mean, there's a TV show about him, so it's pretty obvious he's not real. I do not believe in Bigfoot because there is no hard evidence at this point to suggest that he really exists. Hi, I'm Mitchell Moneymaker, and I've been trying to hunt Sasquatch for like two hours now. And I feel like I'm getting close. I have him walking around this island, and I know there's a Squatch about. Uh, I'm Luke. Uh, I'm Mitchell's uh, trapper. I tie snares and stuff so that Mitchell can catch Bigfoot. I've been doing this for like 20 minutes now, and according to Mitchell, I'm a professional kid. This is what he said in quotes. Yeah. Oh, what? What the? What the? Oh, oh, the camera's on. Um. Well, uh, hi. Um, uh, I'm, I'm Moneymaker Mitch. I've been out here for about, like, uh, about two days now, I think. I've been trying to find the elusive Sasquatch. And I know he's in this woods. I can smell him. I can taste him. He's around. How do you do that? Who do that? So if old Bigfoot's wandering through here, it'll take a little step, walk, caught in that hole. Jeez, we got him. We got him good. Hey, hello. Where'd you set up the traps? Master, oh, it didn't work. Duh. <laughs> Check it out. I found Bigfoot. That is some genuine squatch hair. Hmm. It's mm. definitely Bigfoot. Go investigate that lead, Jonas. You got it. You got it. Okay. Hey, uh, Luke. Yeah? Have you seen Jonas? He's been missing for a while. I sent him to go investigate that squatch hair. No, I haven't seen him. Where, where, where'd he go? Ah! Mike. <laughs> we gotta go! It's been a couple days since our fiasco in the woods while trying to hunt Bigfoot. Ever since then, the weather has taken a turn for the worse. We'd have to pack it up, go inside, and recuperate from what happened. Hmm. While hunting Bigfoot, we found minimal evidence that the wolfman might be hiding in the woods. However, now we're going to be using GoPros, and we're going to go back in the woods, and we're going to hunt this foul creature. All right, we're back in the woods. We're hunting. The beast, once again, weather's not great. We're gonna keep finding, we're gonna keep looking for that, that foul creature. According to our tracker Jonas here, on our trail cams we found a very mysterious creature heading southeast. We're gonna follow it right now. Mitchell, what is that? It was a squatch hand. Let's say it's two hours old, maybe. I don't know what could have caused this, though. I don't know what else is in these boots. What could be dangerous enough to take down a squatch? Wolfman. Wolfman! He's going for a jog! Let's get him. Let's get him. We gotta get him. We gotta get him. Jonas, what are you doing? What? what? Is this the best idea? Yes. Go, 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 go. Get him, Jonas, get him. Alright, gents. I have one last strategy left. I always save it for last. Make sure to do it until your last breath. You got that? What do we do? Run! Oh, 
Dude, I think I think I think he got Mitchell. I can't believe Mitchell's dead. Yeah, I can't believe we just left him like that. Yeah. Mitchell, you're yeah. alive. Yeah. Well, here I am. Been two months intensive care. It's been real hard for me. It's been hard on my family, but I'm, I've made it through it, and now I'm rocking the wheelchair. I've actually been doing some pretty sick tricks on it. Um, uh, not to brag or anything, but I think it's safe to say this hunt is over. We've got all the evidence we need. I was completely abandoned by my two closest friends, um, uh, Luke and Jonas, who mocked me for not joining the track team. It was embarrassing. But I managed to fight the beast off nonetheless. I escaped with the skin of my pants, but at what cost? But I'm still alive, and I'm still fighting. We may have not found conclusive evidence on Bigfoot, but the Wolfman is out there. I'm alive. That was definitely a wild ending. I did not expect there to be a wolf, man. What about you, Q? Science nowadays, you never know what you'll find. Exactly. Jonas must have some meaty forearms to throw a nice snowball like that. He could probably take QD's spot pitching on the team. Speaking of pitching, we gotta go throw some balls around. So, uh, that'll be it for us today. It's Shout not out. really gonna be it for me, though. Cause I stay big! Ah!